All right, hello everybody. Welcome to this video. We're gonna show you a super quick and easy way to uh, get the fastest Walton mining settings with this little trick that my roommate and I wrote up. And so the first thing we're gonna do is I've left a link to a zip file uh, in the description and you're gonna wanna click that link and download it. And once you do, you're gonna have something that looks like this, Walton easyminer.zip and what this is is basically just a combination of a few commands that will start the Walton Miner using 100% of the threads on your computer uh, and it is all optimized and automated so that you don't have to keep entering your address again and all this stuff so what you want to do is extract the files uh, I would recommend going down to your local disk to program files and in program files uh, there'll be a folder for WTC so I would do that just extract it to program files WTC and hit OK okay so once you're in the Walton folder and you've extracted that you'll see two new files the first one is easyminer.bat and the second one will be somewhere further down start automated dot bat and what you'll want to do maybe then is right click on easy miner and uh, send to your desktop and what that'll do is create a shortcut right here on your desktop that you can click super easily <coughs> super easily and then once you've done that you can go ahead and close out this window and double click on the shortcut and it'll ask you to specify your etherbase address. You only have to do this once. Once you've done it, you hit you hit yes and I'm going to put in my own address. Once you've done this once, the next time you can say no. So, we'll put in the address and once you hit enter, it starts the miner here. So, you have two windows. You have the miner here and on the left you have a hash rate monitor. So, you can see that we've started mining a block just now and what I'll do is just to make it easy I'll minimize this for now uh, and we'll go into task manager and you can see that I'm using almost all of my CPU for the command prompt that I just created on Walton EXE a little bit for my recording streaming recording here but the rest of it's all for Walton uh, and so this will be really helpful to anyone who has a Threadripper or a Ryzen or something with a lot of cores that is over the thread limit that is in the main Walton program. So a few other, one other nice thing you can do in here is now you have a hash rate monitor. You can close this window if you want to, but you can also type in miner.gethashrate and that'll show you how fast your hashes are going and of course it'll take a few minutes to get up to the maximum or average speed that you're gonna have but other than that you're all done so that's all it's as easy as that uh, if you need to stop mining you just close this window and you're all done and the next time you start it up again you can just hit no and it starts automatically on the same address that you put before. So you can see right here that it actually is using the same address that I just put in a minute ago without having to do anything else. So that's it. I just figured this would make things easier for people who are trying to maximize their mining settings going into PowerShell or something like that and they don't want to have to do it every time and risk having a typo in the address or something. So that's all. Hope you liked it and goodbye.